Hey there, Becca here from Inside the Square. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create a simple back to top button for your Squarespace website. We'll place this button in the footer of your website and anytime someone clicks on it, they'll be directed to the top of the page. Without further ado, I'll go ahead and share my screen to teach you how to set this up in Squarespace. Here we are inside Squarespace, and I do want to mention this tutorial is specific for version 7.1, the latest version of Squarespace. What we're going to do is add a button to the footer that links to the top of our page. And then we're going to add just a little bit of custom CSS so that the computer browser will smoothly scroll back to the top of the page instead of just jumping there directly. You'll see what I mean when we test this button. So let's go ahead and add this to the footer of our website so it's visible on every page. I'll select Edit. Scrolling all the way down to the bottom of my site, you'll see Edit Site Footer when you hover over the footer. Clicking on this option, I have a page section here, so I'll go ahead and select Add Block, and we'll add a button. Now for my own design, I'm going to move this to the center of the screen, but you can place this button anywhere you want to. Double-clicking on this button, we can change the text, and I'll write Back to Top, and we'll attach a link. That link is just a hashtag symbol. That will link to the top of whatever page we happen to be on, but this part is super duper important. I want you to toggle off Open a New Tab. We want this to happen on the same page, not in a new tab of our browser. Okay, we've got this all set. Now, a quick reminder, once the link loads, let's double check our mobile view. You might want to make some adjustments to the mobile version of your site. I like stretching it to full width for my own design style, but again, super customizable. Back here in desktop, it's placed where we... <clears throat> it's still in the same spot, so we'll go ahead and select Save and Exit. Now, unfortunately, we can't test this button here in edit mode. It's not going to work. So I'm going to open up this site in an incognito browser window. Now I can test what we've created. Scrolling down here, I'll click back to top, and it'll instantly load at the top of the page. While that's great, I prefer the smooth scroll effect. So the next thing we're going to do is add this code to our CSS. Back here inside Squarespace, I'm going to select Website then Website Tools, then Custom CSS. This is where we'll paste that code. This is listed in the description below. What this code says is anytime we have scroll behavior on the entire page, I want it to be smooth. We'll go ahead and select Save, and back in our incognito window, I'll scroll down and I'll click back to top, and we'll see it smoothly scrolls to the top of the page. Adding this custom code to your CSS is totally optional, but I think it's a great way to make that back to top button work just a little bit better. Underneath this video, you'll find an outline of the steps that we took to make this magic happen on our Squarespace website and links to related content. So if you enjoyed this tutorial, definitely check those out. Thanks so much for watching. And most importantly, have fun with your Squarespace website. Bye for now. Find everything you need to make Squarespace uniquely yours at InsideTheSquare.co. That's InsideTheSquare.co.